Hey, everybody. So this is going to be a pretty good podcast, I think, because the first one we talked about mindset. So hopefully now you are stirred up, you're motivated, you have the mindset that you're going to overcome and be an achiever. And if you run across something, you're not going to go, that's a scam. That never works. I'm the little guy. Yeah. Words of death. So now we are, I'm an achiever. I am awesome. Kings and queens step aside. Remember that song? Bad to the bone. Just hit me. You know, I was a stagehand for them for a little while. Okay. Actually, I was a stagehand with the Rolling Stones. Yes, I am that old. And with Stage Right Productions out of Baton Rouge, Louisiana. And they were um, just on, on a couple of the tours. So we did work for them. Okay, so let's get back to work here. See, it's rant stuff, too. So what is this big, ugly screen I have pulled up? It's called Screencast-O-Matic. And let's drag the screen up so you may see. Remember, you can always click in the bottom right and enlarge your screen. Can you see that now? There is your URL, screencast-o-matic.com. You can do free. You can do paid. I do paid because I do a ton of stuff with Screencast-O-Matic i.e. the Paul Darby Pod Show. So there is a great resource, and it takes screen capture videos. It'll take webcam videos. You can upload them, write them to, upload them right to YouTube. And now, all of a sudden, you've got some production going. So let's show you something else free, and then I'm going to tie it into today's uh, podcast overview. All right, so paint, another free thing. I use paint for, I always have, always have. So I'm just drawing stuff, and I was going to have all this drawn and then just welcome y'all um, to it. And I went, no, let me show them how I do it, not just welcome them to it. All right. So what I've drawn here is our funnel. Now move it down. I'm going to click A because that makes letters. And we're going to do a video on the process. And in the process, you're going to learn how I do stuff and how you may or may not choose to do it too. Here's what I'm going to be focusing on. How to do most of this stuff free and fast and easy. I like free and fast and easy when it makes a bunch of money. And then you make money and you go, well, I need to start spending a bunch. Yeah, whatever. I get it. I like to shop too. That's why a lot of us are on the internet. All right, so we have the sales funnel. Now, what is the sales funnel? <clears throat> what comprises that? That's our copy, which is words online. The stuff that we write is called our copy. And on ad copy, we have two different kinds. We have short copy and long copy. Guess the difference. And they each have their own rules of behavior on how to be the most effective. Remember this radio station and always listen to it. W-I-I-F-M. And it's called the What's In It For Me radio. Always Focus on what's in it for your prospective customer or your current customer when you are delivering. Delivering, for example, right now I'm talking to prospective customers and current customers. Whether or not you're paying anything right now, you're still a current customer with me. Because I remember I did ask for pay that you go to the bottom after you see each free podcast and tell me what you thought and if you have suggestions, give those. So. There you go. Now you're a customer. And I also want to upgrade you if you want to premium membership. So what am I doing? I'm always be selling, always selling, and I'm always sharing why my value is higher than your money. So your money will be worth less to you and you'll give me your money because you want this value, right? All right. So everything has to focus on that. And everything goes into your sales funnel. So let's talk now for a second about, and we'll make this a different color, that easy. And now I want to make a bunch of those. So I'm just going to hit control copy, and I'm going to paste them in, and I'm going to move them around. And I saw a course somebody taught on this, and it was like thousands of dollars, and it was very good. I taught it much earlier than they did, and I don't want to charge you thousands of dollars. I think I'll charge you, oh, nothing. How would nothing be? That's what we call this a free podcast. All right. So 
you can make images like this and get fancy or not fancy. I'll show you later how to cut and paste um, transparent images in. You can make these transparent. Paint is free and it's super easy to use. Just play with it a while. All right, so now what we have is these little red things. That's going to be, say, a, a free Facebook ad. And everything I talk about will eventually be a podcast. Like, what's a free Facebook ad? I can't do all of it per podcast or the podcast would be 12 years long. So all of these things are advertising, our emails, our sales letters, our, the stuff that we do to get people to our web page goes into our sales funnel. There's a couple of quick things that you want to remember with that, even past what I already told you. And those quick things are, let me blow this down to about 20. Those quick things are... You always be selling. Those of you that have watched TV for a number of years, you'll remember the movie about that, Boiler Room and all that. I was hot into all that stuff when it was on. So you always want to sell. Look at your ad. And, and you remember the radio station. What's in it for me? So look at your ad. Look at what you're doing. Is it selling? We don't want it just to be pretty. We don't want it just to be what other people are doing. We want it to be selling. Remember how we sell? We say, what I have here is worth more to you than your money. Because right now their money is worth heavy. And your stuff is, nah, maybe it's good, it's not. So the first thing you want to remember is make your value more. How do we do that? Well, again, it does not have to be pretty, but how we do that is the W-I-I-F-M, what's in it for me? Share with your market what's in it for them. And this is where I'm going to end today with this little note. A niche market, which is your sales funnel, pulls into your web page and all your stuff, all your ways of contacting people and letting them see what you got going all over the world, all over the internet, goes into your sales funnel, delivers to typically your sales page or an affiliate sales page. And your sales page needs to be set up with what's in it for me. So all of these people, you don't want to be a salesperson to all people. Very good point. Remember this. Niche market means that you want to find a group of people that need a product or service and have a money or product or service that are buying the product or service. Let me give you an example. Look around your room and see what you bought. That's a niche market. For example, I'm looking across the way, I can see a CD player and I have CDs. So you might want to sell CDs. You might want to sell CD players or coffee cups. Let's talk about money right now because um, I'm big into the how to make money online. I do a bunch of other stuff and I'm going to show you how to do that too because frankly, most everything is easier than how to do money online because that's what a zillion people are doing. You have to be really good at it to make money at it. All right. So everything in your sales funnel, this is where we end today, dumps onto your web page. And your web page needs to have you always be selling and what's in it for me. And so we're going to do the anatomy of a great sales page, splash page, and other pages as well. So you will know how to set these up really easy. You can do it all with free stuff and paint and image cut and paste. Oh my gosh, this is going to be good. So today what we get? All of our stuff needs to be selling, whether it's long copy or short copy. All of our stuff is selling as long as we're making about our niche market. A niche market may be a dog owner or a golfer or, or pregnant ladies or whatever, or drone flyers or a a game that's popular, sellers, whatever a product or service is, the people that want it, that's your niche market. So we're going to learn how to focus on them, find them, and offer them the thing that makes them go, oh my gosh, what you have is worth more than the money I have. Okay, that's today's podcast. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.